and there's more. Hello. Hi. Um, I had a dream last night where someone literally, I, I was, it was as if I was watching my comment section from the dream. Like I was in the dream watching my phone and someone wrote obese, obese. A troll was like fat, fat shaming me. And they're like obesity or something like that. And, and spirit just showed me again, like showed me trollish behaviors, like trolls that are dying out. Cause like you're not feeding them, but it's ironic because here I am talking about trolls but what I'm actually getting because yesterday I had a message too that the 3d matrix like manifesting manifestation itself is a printing system it's it's a printer it's like what you have been feeding it for two to three days two to three months two to three weeks like whatever it is that you've been um, associating yourself with has to kind of like feed through the the printer system you know and then you putting in good shit today is literally giving you good tomorrow. But if you've been like me around a lot of trolls and a lot of people who are just so fucking stupid <laughs> on the split, bitch, um, on the split page of swords, so stupid, right? If you've been around ignorant assholes like me, as long as you have, it has to kind of like purge out. So there's going to be definitely some people that get triggered. Look at this 10 of wands. Look, look, this is the spy card. Really people who have spied and, and, and put all that on you whatever, whatever, let it just see it for what it is. It's just the printer system. It's, it's feeding that through and the paper will soon be done and you will have nothing but heaven on earth. Ah. Heaven on earth. Just amazing fucking people who know you and love you. Oh my God. There's the eight, there's the ace of swords for the truth. Okay. The truth. You're speaking now what you want tomorrow. And it's going to pay off. You best believe that. You best believe that. So don't really pay any attention to it. This is like the first time I've ever not wanted to get loud and rowdy with a troll. Like before, before I would, I would. Cause like, I just, I'm an Aries. And when you're a hammer, everything's a nail. You know what I mean? But this time I'm like, I see it. I see it for what it is. I see the zeros and the ones in the matrix. I understand how manifestation really works now. And I'm like, okay, yeah. Um, I'm not even about to acknowledge you besides right now in this video to help someone I'm not even about to acknowledge you I get it now like my twin came into my life recently and he was like I wish you wouldn't be so aggressive I wish you wouldn't tell all these I, like they're winning they win when you acknowledge their existence and I was like don't talk to me don't talk to me you're telling me I'm not allowed to talk to trolls the way I want don't talk to me right but now understanding it from a level of like Ah, okay, I see now. Oh, I see why I shouldn't do that. Right? The Empress, first of all, an Empress probably wouldn't even bother. An Empress, really, 303 on the clock, the number three here. An Empress wouldn't even give a shit. She'd be like, I'm sorry, who are you? <laughs> I don't I don't know you. Um Okay. Uh this was my divine masculine being like, Yeah, you should probably just like stop and say you did like just stop and 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 just move on but i was like no fuck that they don't get to win they don't get to look at this the tower it's always causing my own cataclysmic events in my life like every time every time i would argue with these 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 like dodo brains every time i would be like why am i going through a tower moment though why do i keep getting bad karma like why do i keep bringing in more of this shit hello earth the jenna you're literally manifesting things you think about. And even in my dreams, I'm literally manifesting trolls. So I need to stop thinking about trollish behavior. Trollish behavior is such a thing of the past, okay? That ship has sailed. We don't talk about that shit. We talk about money. We talk about our sugar daddy, which is the universe. That's what we talk about. We talk about this printer system that's about to print out millions and billions and trillions of dollars for your girl. And yesterday I had proof of it. I went to the store and I pulled into the only parking spot available and there it was. 20 or so lottery tickets all scattered on the ground. They were all scratched off, yeah. Yeah, and they were all losers, but, but, just like trolls are losers, I could have instantly picked one of them up and been like, nope, this one's a winner. This one's a winner, I'm gonna go take it in. I didn't want to pick it up because I was like, this, that's kind of gross, I, don't, I didn't want to. I didn't want to. I'm like, I'll let, the, I'll let the millions come in some other way. But, but, I pick, I, uh, in my head, I thought, okay, I could pick one of these up, 
go inside and find out that that person that, that scratched it off totally missed it. So anyway, I'm getting a lot of recognition from the universe that your money's on the way, your money's on the way. Why? Because you're not, you're not talking to trolls anymore. You don't even associate yourself with anything other than abundance now, Empress. Right? Let them say what they're going to say, honey. Let them say what they're going to say. It's a printer system. Eventually, if all you see is good, the only thing that can show up is good. That's it, literally. That's it. Nothing bad can even exist in your reality if all you see is shmoney. All I see is the bag, honey. That's all I see. That is all I witness anymore in my visualizations is me going to the ATM being like, one million, please. That's it. That's all I see, right? The fool. But it's going to take a little bit of a reset. It's going to take a little bit of like a, okay, guys, get through this first because the shit thought you had for a minute, totally horrendous. You believed that trolls could come at you. You believed in the gunk that they were spewing and throwing your way. Okay, fine. It's okay happens to the best of us. Let it feed through the printer. Let that go through the printing system and then you will enter the promised land. It'll become, it'll, and what I'm hearing is some of you, it'll happen overnight because you, you stopped feeding that negative bullshit overnight. I heard this is what legends are made of. And this is why a lot of people get super, super envious when people start actually getting like really the Empress, when you start getting your shit, this is why people get mad. Because it happens for you overnight and people are like, why? Why though? Why did God hand you this? Why you? Why you? Because you fucking changed your thoughts overnight. So one day the printer is just going to be good, 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 good. It's just going to be feeding good. feeding. It's, that's it. If you can turn it on a dime overnight. Stop it completely. Stop it in its tracks. Like that. The printer has to start printing out good. And some of you, it might be like a shock to the system. Some of you, it might even be, look at this temperance. It might even be so crazy that I think that's the message right now is like a lot of you are going to be seeing that it's, it's insane in the membrane. Like it will not make sense. It won't make sense. How it goes from complete darkness to complete light, like overnight, it won't make sense. And a lot of you are, you might be changing your thoughts and you think it's great, you know, you're affirming, you think it's great, you, th you don't even know happiness yet. It depends on how fast are you stopping from bad thoughts to good thoughts. How often? How often do you change your thoughts the second you say like, oh, well, I'm broke. Nope, nope, actually, no, I have a million dollars in my bank. How often are you doing that throughout the day? That is how quick your 3D reality, that 3D printer could show you a different result depending on you. It's you. It's divine timing. You are divine timing. There is no, there's nothing outside of you. You are God and there is no other. Okay. All right. So this Empress here, 10 of Pentacles. I love it. I love it. You guys are just like not feeding the trolls anymore. Troll bots. Hey man, you got, you got enlightened. Look at this, the death card. Oh my God. I love it. You guys are done being stuck too. Like you're done being stuck. It's like, you, bro, the only thing you were doing was keeping yourself in that cyclical loop. That's why I'm so grateful my twin came into my life. He woke my ass up. He was basically Trinity in the, in the Matrix, the movie, when, when she was typing on his computer, like, Neo, you're in the Matrix, Neo. The Matrix has you, Neo. <laughs> so he came in and he's like, bitch, get your shit right. Because <laughs> this is offensive. I don't like it. Yeah, I, one of the most embarrassing things I've ever heard in my life was him say, like, because I, I yelled at somebody in my, in my live stream. And uh, ironically, it was a Scorpio, uh, a Scorpionic X from hell, right? And, and I, I called him out. I called the Scorpio out. And I was like, stop watching my shit. Stop watching me. Go away, go away, go away. And my twin watched my stream and he was like, I didn't like you. I thought you were like really unattractive at that moment. I didn't like you. Like it actually turned him off so bad we fought about it. And we were like, okay, I think we have to like part ways. Like that's how bad it was. I was really, really... Like, I was going to war with a troll bot, basically. And he was like, I, I didn't like that. I didn't like that, so I think we're done. And I remember that. It was so embarrassing. I was like, no, what? And then I had to defend my stance in defending myself. But really, guys, really, as I look at it now, I'm like, an empress should not have, does not have to lift a damn finger. You don't have to do anything to defend yourself. You let God defend you.
you let your actions speak for themselves. You let your money speak for itself. You let your you, you let your success speak for itself. You don't have to wrestle in the mud with pigs. Okay? They will they will bring you down to their level and beat you at their own game. You you don't want that. And so he was like he was like every time you do that, every time you do that they win. They're literally winning. Me, my pompous ego. I was like, nah, fuck him. He's never going to win. He's a loser. <laughs> but really, he was winning. He was winning. And I kept seeing it like he exists. Like this, this, this thing outside of me exists. No, it doesn't exist. It doesn't exist. If you stop giving it momentum, if you stop feeding it, it doesn't exist. Right? It depends on how quickly... We are, ladies, the empress, how quick, and gentlemen, how fast are you going to turn your thoughts from like, oh, that was a dickbag thing to say, what an asshole, what an asshole, to, never mind, I'm an empress, I, I'm sorry, who are you? Have a good one, bye, I've got to go do something more important, like, I don't, I don't give a fuck, like, watch paint dry, watching paint dry is more important than, than fighting with a ghost of the past, Okay? So, yeah, my twin, he was just like, look, you were kind of not, I didn't even like you. So, we're done. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. A real emperor would say something like that. A real emperor would call everybody out that acted like that. So, yeah, he was just like, no, it's kind of unattractive. I'm out. <laughs> Bye. It made my head spin. Nobody has ever cut me off like that. I, I cut people off like that, but, like, to have him do it, oh, God, the Wheel of Fortune, the star. Look, guys, I'm telling you, how fast can you do this? How fast can you turn your fate in your favor? I don't know. How fast do you want to heal your fucking thoughts? How fast do you want to say, nope, that's not my reality. Nope, there is no troll. Nope, there is no ex. I don't even remember his name. Bye. A couple occasions have come up where his face like will, will permeate my, my, my mind's eye and I don't even remember his name. That's how you know you're making it. You're going to make it. It's going to go really smoothly, smoothly soon. How quickly are you able to turn it, guys? Some of you are going to have that printer print out like good shit, like really good shit. And it's going to be constant, 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 constant. It, it, that might be like so triggering because a lot of you have not seen a good manifestation in a long fucking time. And the reason you haven't is because you keep addressing something from the past. And I just heard in the Bible when it says, uh, you shall not touch dead things or something like that. Dead things like death here with they like, don't touch dead things. It's over. Let it go. Right. So a lot of you have not been getting your manifestations because you keep getting triggered by the 3D and, and acting like that shit's real. It's like you forgot that that's not real. And, and that's why I'm grateful. So grateful for my twin flame. He, he woke me up out of the matrix. He's like, hello, hello. It's embarrassing as shit. Fix your life, Jenna. So that's what I have for you guys. If you really want these blessings, you can have them, but you need to work for it. Start changing your fucking thoughts go from, oh, he's such a dick bag to, nope, actually, he's exactly as I want him. He's exactly as I want him. Trolls, there are no trolls. All I have is abundance. All I have is good people. All I have is lovely. I just, I just win. I win at life. I win, 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 win all day. 24-7, that's it. I am a winner. Look at Queen of Pentacles. Your karma. Your karma, though. Your karma. It's going to start printing, and I keep, spirit keeps showing me it's going to print, and it's going to print, and it's going to print, and it's not going to stop. And some of you, I keep hearing, you're not going to even believe it. This is your karma. Queen of Pentacles, this is your karma. So my birds before land, in, manifest, in manifesting terms, the birds before land reference, if you ever hear it in the community, it means seeing something before your real manifestation comes in, but it's like, it's like a, it's confirmation that you're about to get it. Those lottery tickets on the ground for me, that was confirmation because I'd been affirming good shit. It's not, it's not what I want yet. Is it millions of dollars in my bank account? Hell no, it was a piece of paper on the ground. But if I keep affirming over and over and over and over and over and over, good shit happens to me. All I do is win, literally all I do is win, guys. If you can change your mindset, you can change and thrive in that. That's it, that's it. Stop getting focused on the 3D bullshit. Even in your dreams, like even in my dream, when this guy was like tormenting me, I, I, I don't even think I responded to it. So let it go, let it go, let it, let the old world go, let the old you die, right? So anyway, guys, I love you all. Leave it there. Have a good one.